No, 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 please, please, no. To those who uh, think Joker Folly Ado is the worst, most unnecessary sequel of 2024, ha! Well, hold my beer, moviegoers everywhere, because Bloods and Honeys, who uh, I cannot think of a single human in existence that uh, wanted this to exist. Ook, 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 ook. It is not possible to uh, watch uh, this uh, thing to make it through it sober. Winnie the Pooh uh, bored and torture me uh, to directed. Whoa. Uh, 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 uh. Or uh, not directed uh, because uh, this uh, is uh, not uh, uh, directing. This is not uh, f filmmaking by Riles uh, Waterfield, however the fuck you, you say his name, I don't care. Same guy uh, that uh, continues uh, to uh, rape and uh, uh, d destroy uh, our our childhood, Wh Winnie the Pooh, with uh, his uh, fucked up uh, Winnie the Pooh horror slasher cinematic universe uh, that uh, no sane human w would enjoy and is the uh, completely and utterly pointless, uh, beyond unnecessary, beyond unasked for uh, sequel, uh, and that that's uh, had a no purpose being made. I mean, we. I mean, the first Blood and Honey had no right to exist, uh, but but this one even more so. Uh, so uh, I. What? Why the hell are they even going ahead with a? Fuzz, uh, just, uh, stop uh, these, uh, fucking Winnie the Pooh horror slashers already, uh, uh, or I am going to lose my fucking shit. So, uh, bored and torture me too, tells the story taking place after the events of, uh, its uh, predecessor where, uh, Pooh and uh, Christopher Robin are now have got a a sheer rivalry with one another. You know what, so who, who the fuck cares? Uh, it uh, is uh, just a uh, poo, uh, uh, you know, gathering even more of the uh, Hundred Acre Wood gang who have uh, renounced their uh, humanity and uh, cuteness and uh, they g go around uh, slaughtering a bunch of innocent uh, uh, teenagers and uh, uh, y y yeah, that's that's if you really want to know. Oh, exactly uh, what one year ago, to be exact, I uh, uh, did my most extreme epic rant on the worst movie of that year, the first Bloods and Honey, and I am speechless that we have to do this again, that we have to just uh, lay into another one of these uh, things to... Uh, I think you're 0% surprised that bored and torture me too. Bug exams! Whoa. Holy fuck. I mean, did I just uh, shatter a uh, gl glass uh, with my, with, with my uh, rage uh, uh, for this piece of a uh, fucking shit? Yeah, this uh, is, uh, well, the uh, worst uh, thing I to release in 2024. It's a uh, should it should not even be classified uh, as uh, a movie. Yeah, it, it's like uh, a punishment to censor to uh, punish all of uh, uh, humanity uh, from uh, fr from hell. It's it is every bit uh, as a shit, if not even shittier, than its predecessor. When Rotten Tomatoes uh, rated this a 100% when the first reactions uh, got out, wow. Rotten Tomatoes, you just hit a new fucking low. 
how do people give this a pass but not Joker Folly Ado? Who is with me that Joker Folly Ado is, uh, well, uh, infinity, uh, times infinity better than this? People were, were, were defending Ward and Torture Me too, just because, oh, at least it's not as cheap as the first movie, at least it's got a bigger budget and the character designs and and the gore have improved, and at least it's more fun. Oh, uh, uh, bull fucking shit. Uh, I, that, uh, did not sway me what one bit. Uh, just because it had a slightly larger budget of one million dollars, one million is still pathetic, uh, but by the way, I mean, it's, uh, still a looks, uh, like, uh, us, and, uh, it's a still a look so uh, well, it still is, is how not to make a Winnie the Pooh movie 101. fucking one How could anybody uh, get uh, amusement out of seeing Pooh and the Hundred Acre Wood Gang be raped uh, this bad and, uh, and become like uh, Fr Freddy Krueger in a... Uh, in the first uh, one, we only saw Pooh and Pigless. In this one, we see, well, far more of the gang except for Eeyore. With, uh, we see Owl and Tigger and j join the bloodthirsty crew. And uh, Owl, uh, look at his design, is uh, the worst of the worst. He looks like a uh, fucked up a harpy or something. Not, not an owl. Watching uh, this uh, was... Uh, uh, so challenging that uh, it felt uh, like uh, somebody was literally holding a chainsaw to my head, uh, forcing me to sit through the entire fling, though it uh, took uh, all the willpower in the world uh, to not walk out of it, and uh, it uh, felt like uh, a entire uh, y year in, uh, in the shittiest, uh, jail cell imaginable. C Christopher Robin, uh, is, uh, well, uh, j just as, uh, hateable a character as, uh, Pooh and the Hundred Acre Wood Gang here. It's his fucking fault that they turned out this way. And, uh, like, uh, its predecessor, it is one of the most, uh, sexist and anti-female, uh, 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 p piles of uh, shits that ever met. He's, I don't think it's possible for a female moviegoer to uh, give this a positive review because the very f after the uh, opening animated narrated segment, so which is uh, just as uncomfortable uh, to, to watch as uh, the one in the first movie. Uh, you, we see a uh, who literally massacre. Uh, three uh, innocent teenage girls, I'm like, oh, where the fuck is the girl power here? Uh, like, uh, not that the uh, shitheads uh, that uh, fought so uh, bored and torture me too uh, was was uh, worthy to green light to uh, give a fuck. Yeah, I can't believe I'm saying this, but I would even uh, rather be watching uh, Despicable Me 4 than th this. Uh, yeah. It is, uh, it is that, uh, uh atrocious. <laughs> and Christopher Robin, uh, killing Pooh Bear at the end, uh, like, by splitting Pooh's head open and Al becoming the new big bad, which is just, uh, the laziest and forced as fuck a cliffhanger ending I have ever seen, period, to set up a, a board and torture me in uh, number three, I mean... Wow, uh, so how could Christopher Robin ever live with himself uh, for, for killing, killing his beloved Pooh Bear? If Pooh and the Hundred Acre Wood Gang watched this in the cinema, they'd be going, Oh, mother, uh, just uh, put me out of my fucking misery. They would be uh, uh, astonishingly disgusted as I am. They would die of a broken heart and they would be rolling in their hundred-acre wood uh, graves. Yeah, I uh, am uh, outraged uh, that uh, shit like this gets a pass away uh, to it uh, easily. And uh, so, yeah, this is the biggest crime against humanity to ever grace the big screen in 
the entirety of 2024. There is uh, barely anything more I can say about it, so yeah, uh, do yourself a favour and never, ever in your life uh, watch uh, even a glimpse of it, because you will regret it. I give Winnie the Pooh board and torture me to zero nah, a five. Fuck this piece of bull fucking shit. <gasps> okay, okay, guys, I'm, I'm better. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. Ooh. <laughs> well, uh, at least uh, the only uh, positive is that uh, you uh, got so to be entertained by me. Uh, 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 just, uh, 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 j just, uh, uh. A crushing uh, this uh, shit to look like a bug, and yeah, and you know what? Uh, fuck, that's a brand new horror Disney cinematic universe that they are uh, planning, like uh, the Peter Pan one, the Pinocchio one, and the and the Mouse Trapper one, which is the the M Mickey Mouse becoming a serial killer. I am not interested. I don't know who is. Well, I love you guys. Thank you for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this extreme epic rant. <laughs> and uh, and uh, do I even need to ask what are your thoughts on Blood and Honey too? If anybody thought this was actually okay, and I mean, I I can understand if you didn't uh, despise it or or loathe it to the core as much as the original. But if anybody gives this a pass and thinks it's okay, then I that th then I will uh, be astonished uh, but uh, but of course it's your opinion please, please comment and let me know please like this video and subscribe please follow me on twitter and on instagram and i'll see you next time and remember movies are us bye guys